Hey everyone, welcome to episode 5 Haunted Man of Let's Build a Theme Park in Minecraft PE Haunted Mansion Part 3. So, as you can see, we did a little bit of the roof. We just did spires like this, and they go up, up, and point all the way up. So it just has this basic shape. Something like this, except enlarged. And we put, we broke, and we broke some panes and put some cobwebs in there. But before I go any farther, I need to introduce a very special guest. Princess Cleo, come on out! I would, but I'm stuck in the house. Okay, well, I'll just break something. Hello, everybody! So here is Princess Cleo. How do you feel to be on our show? Um, yeah. cool. That, that was a weird question. So, <laughs> we're just breaking a bunch of glass panes and putting cobwebs in them, and then I scattered a bunch of cobwebs, like, everywhere. And I'm going to keep doing that. Also, I added a row of slabs around here, just like that, and we have a nice bell here. It's a piece of wool, and then we have, like, five bells on it. So, now, just you never have too much bells. add a bunch of cobwebs all around this. This is basically what I did, just randomly tapping and getting bells, and we need to cover that. There we go. Just randomly tap, add cobwebs. Did I say randomly tap and add bells? You said randomly tap and add cobwebs. Okay, good. So, randomly tap and add cobwebs. That is what I meant to say. Okay, do you like the windows? That is beautiful. And the windows are beautiful. Yay. So, now then, I will spread jack-o'-lanterns over here in the bell room. We should put in some cave spiders here. <laughs> cave spiders? On this? I think it's set on piece one. Yeah, I guess it does. Yeah, you know how much I love piece one. Yep. That looks really creepy. That's perfect. I love it. I love it, too. Okay. All the jack-o'-lanterns decided to come in unison, Look, and there's a bat. everyone needs to face bat forward. There's a bat. This is a, bat. This is a resident vampire. Can't put them on those slabs. Do you like our resident bat? Here is our bat. We'll put more pumpkins Just over here. here. Okay. Two on each side. First, I'll go around and do there. That one has a little more than two, but whatever. I'm thinking for some of the lighting, we should do like lanterns. But look how creepy that looks. Yeah, lanterns Just, like, really add to the creepy factor. Turns up. Nothing means I'm not good at not saying them sporadically. I usually have to do that. But. Nothing can be nice and symmetrical. So I'll just grab lanterns like Princess Cleo is suggesting. There has to be a way to get into the haunted house, though. Yep, there will be. Are you going to get in underground? Ooh, I'm no. just going to put a piece of that there. Oh, yes. That's too symmetrical. Yes, they're unsymmetrical. You need to put one like there. Fine. But that just bugs me. <laughs> and then a couple, like, around here, maybe. What do you think? I'm gonna just put one on a cobweb, just for the kick of it. Just to... Here's the famous... I'm not putting it on there. Hmm. Can't put lanterns. Ooh, brilliant! We just put lanterns around these edges to up the creepy factor and the super detailed factor. Mm-hmm. Never skimp out on the details. That's my personal motto. Yep. Would that be two in the middle? There. Nice and off skelter. Looks good. So now we will admire it from the front. Look how beautiful that looks. Gorgeous. That's the side. Oh. I knew that. <laughs> Going down, 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 down. It's nice how bright it is. That way it is illuminating. Yeah, illuminated. Okay, so we are now sleeping in a bed. Well, I'm jumping on you. And you are sleeping. jumping on me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So there's a lantern next to the bed. You mind up my bed? 
Anyways, we have this nice haunted mansion, and I need to put some lanterns on the roof. Lanterns on the rooftops. Lanterns on the rooftops. Okay. <laughs> That's enough singing. Lanterns, 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 lanterns. Need some more lanterns up here. There we go. This looks perfectly creepy. I was going to say perfectly positively creepy. But that, 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 that just doesn't sound right. I like how it either way, it looks perfectly creepy. It looks good, but it's not actually creepy creepy. Yeah, it looks creepy, but not... So like, creepy that it's like, ugh, yeah. No, no ugh. Like, ugh, oh, sorry. No. Disdainful. Yeah, it looks beautiful. So it's now... Beautifully creepy. On the inside, we need to decide something to do on the inside. You want to get in. Like a mine train ride right here. Right where? Right here. Are we wanting a mine train ride or are we wanting a walkthrough? Probably a mine train ride. Probably. So we'll make a basic track. How okay. many floors is it? It is two floors. I'm getting so, my steps in, people. I'm going to extend this porch out to the side because it's going to come out on the side. You should make the door. You kind of just jump through the pain. The panes. You kind of just jump through the glass. Cobwebs. Glass and cobwebs. Why are you mining up the glass? Because this is the entrance. This is? Yeah. Well, it needs to look positively creepy, though, so I'm going to... There we go. Perfect. Okay, so here's the ride start. And then we're going to come in here. Ooh, that, 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 that would look cool, actually. That looks dramatic. <clears throat> we're going to come around like this. We're going to go up, up, up. We're going to come around here. Turn again. Right here. Then we'll turn again over to here. Actually, that's too close. Turn again right here and go up. And then we're going to turn. Go up. Is that too big? And then we'll turn again. Actually, I'm trying to figure out how to get this to fit. Yeah. Well, they gotta be able to see all the creepy sights. It's not a crazy roller coaster ride. Yeah, I'm just trying to get it to like tour well. It's not really good. Maybe if I like do this, I would suggest zigzags. Cause zigzag can make everything creepier. Good idea. So we're gonna zigzag. A sudden turn, so you can see the creepy things that are new aspect. Come in here, come out this window. That looks cool. <laughs> and out here. Now then, it is time to do some interior design in this. What do you think? Uh, since it's gonna have two floors, don't you think it should go up to the second floor? You know? Maybe. Why is there a llama in the haunted mansion? No one knows. He could be the haunted llama! Hi, haunted llama. We should name him. Harry the Haunted Llama. So I am actually going to go up a couple more rows. I'm going to see if I can use commands to do that. Name something? Like commands? Mm -hmm. I don't think you can. But anyways, he'll come out like this. Come down. That is too much. Down. I feel like it gets too complicated if we go up to the second floor. And that is just way too high. Darn. That didn't work. So, now we will... That is the wrong settings. We'll change... Princess Cleo to an operator! I fell all the way down to the floor. I don't just, I just don't know how we're gonna add a second floor under this. We should have phantoms swooping around in here. That would look super cool. And creepy. 
Need some ghastly flooring here. And ghasts. Ghasts and phantoms. Well, of course, people are going to be in a survival or adventure, so... Yeah. That would probably, um, to kill them. Because phantoms are a little <laughs> um, intent on your death. Phantoms have a couple of anger issues. Just a couple, though. Like many other mobs that I know. Eat honey. I'm talking to you, creepers! I'm drinking honey. Okay, I'm <laughs> um, uh, I okay. would think maybe some barrels with cobwebs hanging around a little bit, because those are kind of creepy. Yeah, and then definitely some skeleton kind of. skulls. Armor stands with skeletons. Maybe. So we need some skeleton skulls around here. Some bookshelves. Everything needs cobwebs. Actually, maybe add some mossy cobblestone just to, you know, add up the creep faster. Factor, not faster. I am going to go Ooh, all the way vines. around vines this. Creepy. Make this whole thing. You should make all of that one block up because I'm going to make the bottom gray wool. So you can't see the outside, inside of the haunted mansion. So you can't see all the wood part. So I'm just going to go around this with gray wool. Why? Mm, just for fun. I feel like this is like the biggest project we've done. It takes it's taken the most episodes. Three. Well, you've only had five episodes. Yeah. So. 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 I am mining. I am mining. <laughs> so, a nice ghastly staircase. Why do I keep using ghastly? I guess it's because ghastly is a good word for this. Maybe it's because you like ghasts. <laughs> they are cool, you have to admit. Yeah. When viewed from the natural texture pack, they look extremely sad. They do, always. Like, they look like they're about to cry, and they're just like, eh, poor guests. But they always look sad, and then they're always like, meh. Yeah. yeah, I feel bad for guests. Over here, we need bookshelves. Thank you. Shelves. Shelf those books. <laughs> Shelving units. Hi, yeah. baby. Hi, baby. Okay. We're giving you a nice, good view of this room in case you wanted to stare off in space at the room for a second. <laughs> just because. We need some jack o' lanterns. Of course. Always need jack o' lanterns. More lanterns, of course. Lanterns are dramatic. Then I need. Could you tell I like lanterns? They're more fun. spruce wood. I need to come down there like that. Here we go. Now then, I really like the way this is turning up, but I think we need some chairs. Yeah, some seating. We need chairs, definitely. I'm going to experiment with trapdoors for a table. What do you think? Um, try different trapdoors. So that one doesn't look very much like a table. That one looks like a trapdoor. Mm. Ooh, try dark oak trapdoor. That one looks cool. Yeah, it was not charcoal, but it does look like a chocolate bar. Yeah, it does look like chocolate. Like, you just put two down. But that looks creepy, though, you know. Like, just ghastly chocolate. The chocolate table. Yeah. I am standing on a chocolate table. Wahahaha. <laughs> okay, so now... I'm also stuck in a wall. What else do we want? What else looks ghostly? Ghastly. And ghostly. I would say some barrels with cobwebs. Those look really creepy. Some barrels. Probably some chests. Beehives. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, lecterns. Those are creepy. Look at them. We need a lot of cobwebs. Oh, like you have to find a good spot to put the lectern. I'm thinking maybe like here. Can you find the hidden barrel? Oh. 
<laughs> <laughs> Can you see the barrel at all? No, that's like, too symmetrical. Better yet? We're exactly two blocks away. Part. That should, like, like, one should be, like, back one. Yeah. There's a lot of details in here that you're never going to be able to see. I don't know why I did that. I just wanted to. Some well, maybe there. if they break out of the thing and just climb in, then they can look at it. Yeah. True. And then up there, there's, like, tons of details that you are going to see. And then up here. <laughs> up here. I think we need, like... A a ghastly bed chamber. I'm gonna put an enchanted book on the electron because that just looks cool and creepy. Seeing a floating, shiny, black, not black, it wouldn't be black, it'd be purple technically, book. And then I need to get some wooden slabs for the top up here. I literally just typed in wadden. Darn, I can't do that. Okay, I'm gonna just smear the book. slabs. Some ghastly looking spruce slabs. Some cobwebs. More barrels. A couple more chests. We need a chest like right here. I have a brilliant idea. In the book, I'm going to write Prepare to Die. But um, I don't think I'll be able to that. It'll be kind of cool. Yeah, I don't think you're going to be able to <laughs> read it either. But, you know. I'm just going to write, hi, what up? So now we need some heads. We need some creeper heads. Skeleton heads. No, author is not unknown. Definitely some zombies. There was way too many heads right there. There was zombie head over there. Creeper head there. The Doomsday Book. There we go. The Doomsday Book is on the lecture. You should read it. You can't read it. It doesn't work. Yeah, I'll throw you the book. Read my beloved Here, masterpiece. We have a nice book. Death book. <laughs> Hi, widow. <laughs> well, I figured if somebody was going to come out and be smart enough to actually get it, they should deserve a good message. Yeah, a good message. I think we should put some ender chests in here, because like those are kind of creepy. Dragon heads. With redstone behind them, so their mouths go up and down. That'd be awesome! Ooh, and campfires. Those don't, have that. Those don't actually run in your head. I'm a creepy smoke. See, it makes cool smoke everywhere. But and then we need worse. some torches. Okay. We need some lanterns. Lanterns up here. There. Completely unordinary. I try to make this look like a staircase that goes up with some stairs, like spruce stairs, probably. Mm -hmm. What do you think? And then like, take this. Yeah. And like hide the stairs, hide this mm -hmm. track behind it. Yeah. And so when you come in, it looks like a nice staircase. Mm 